Hey guys, you want to come in? Going to continue on here with the Rome 2 content. And I had put a poll up a couple of days ago um, about what campaign you guys would like to see first. And Saba was the clear winner. So Saba will be the first campaign that is getting started here as far as the three that I was going to say that I'm going to do. I'm going to try and get videos out on them on some sort of a regular basis. Uh, but we'll see how well that goes. But... We are going to be playing here as Saba. I see initially that the campaign is easy, so we're going to leave it on the very hard category because I don't play legendary. Just will not play legendary. The AI cheats way too much in normal. So, I mean, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not, yeah, I'm not going to do that. But Saba, here is their write-up. You guys can take a look at that. It's actually a very small write-up, just that one paragraph there. And then we have the faction... Uh, I guess history here more history about the faction right there so if you guys want to pause the video and feel free actually let me move the cursor out of the way there we'll leave that up there for you guys to be able to watch that just a little bit more if you'd like uh taking a look at our abilities here or our i guess our start offs uh desert warriors plus 10 percent morale for all units during battles in the desert so that'll actually be really good because we start off in the desert uh, Deep-rooted traditions, though, minus seven percent to research rate to start. Ooh, that's that's going to be rough. We're definitely going to have to get that uh, up using other technologies and everything. Uh, then we have down here mercenary armies minus twenty-five percent mercenary upkeep costs. That's pretty solid. And the incense traders plus fifteen percent tariff income from trade agreements. Very, 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 very nice. Uh, I don't know which victory condition I'm going to go for just yet. I don't know. I'm going to have to think about that one because some of them are pretty big. Some of them are pretty big. Yeah, that like 130 units, that's going to be a long, 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 long campaign. But I mean, you guys let me know in the comment section below uh, what you guys would like to see. Military, economic, or cultural victories. So there you go. Let's get ready and I will see you guys in on the campaign map. We are the children of Almaka. We don't seek to rob others of their riches because we grow our own. Centuries ago, our engineers built the Great Dam, and we have since turned the desert into a garden. Over the years, we have learned to live and trade with our neighbors to the north. But there are also those, such as the Gerea to the northeast, whose greed and envy might force us into an unwanted war. Under the circumstances, it would be wise to seek the alliance of the friendly mascot to the east and try to expand our trade operation to the west. Okay, so there we go. That is the beginning part of our campaign. Completely control the following provinces, uh, either by direct ownership or through satrapies and military allies. Arabia Magna. Okay, we will get 3,000 gold for that, 3,000 denarii. Uh, new bonus objective, yeah, okay, cool. All right, there we go. Let's see, let's see. We're going to get into technology first, and I think we're going to go in with the, uh, we're going to get into the civil first here. So we're going to do that, but I want to keep it, I want to see. Mm, I can't look, I can't look. So we're going to have to do this one eventually, but we're going to get into the civil first, start, uh, Getting a little bit more as far as our agriculture, as far as income, and we will be able to make some pretty good farms. So, all right, we start with 937 income, starting off with the 5,000 gold allotment, zero food. Don't think, can I get a spy? I can. All right, let's take a look. Uh, oh, already, I like that guy. Plus two food stolen from local province. I like that one a lot. Oh, plus one from him. I think we're going to go with this guy, though. I'm going to recruit this guy up and get him ready to go. So already, right off the bat, we are down 1,100 gold, which isn't terrible. Not a horrible, horrible thing. Uh, we are going to merge these armies, though. I'm going to get these guys into that army and probably put him in here and get the king himself out. That is our king right there. I believe that is our king, right? Uh, let's see. What is our king's name? Sama Ali Yanuf. Ali Anuf. Is that him? Yes, it is. So that is our king right here. 
We're going to get him out of the settlement, and we're going to put this guy in there. And we're going to give him a couple of units. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Actually, you know what? Hold on. We're not going to do that yet. We're going to build ourselves a military building here, which will unlock the Desert Spearmen and the Slingers. So we're going to get that one going right off the bat. And as far as here, we're going to... Um, actually, since I made the Spy, I'll immediately be able to put him up. Because I plan on going after Gerha uh, pretty quickly here. So we will be able to get our Spy up there. He will start stealing some food for us. So maybe we work on the Commerce over on this side. So we will build a Harbor... That will give us 11,000 gold, 1,100 gold, I mean. Let's get him inside there so he can be part of the uh, part of the garrison there in case anything decides to come over to attack. And we will deploy this guy immediately, so it's a little bit more. Nothing crazy as far as the tax income. Uh, here, I think we're going to recruit a couple of slingers just to get us going here a little bit more. Four units of slingers, desert levies. Four Devil Desert Spearmen, and we do have the uh, Camel Archer General. Two Camel Spearmen. Okay, I think that's pretty good. Let's take a look around, see if anybody wants to do anything with us at all. I so agree let's to see. Us uh, trade agreement? No. Okay, no trade agreement from him. Uh, Mascot, we are already trading. Let's see. Now, the mission... Hold on a second. Let's take a look at the uh, the mission. That is up here. Okay, so that is these three settlements there. So, technically... Technically, we don't actually have to fight the mascot if we can get them to become military alliance with us. That would be fine. So, let's see. Do we have a non-aggression pact with them? We can get one at moderate... Oh, they don't want it. They don't want it yet. Maybe we'll wait and see if they want to come to us with it. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, Axum, they like me, but I, unfortunately I can't do anything with them. The pleasures of my house. Maybe you're not a, oh, they do? Okay. Stranger. All right, all right, all right. So I'll take some First money from though, that, from, though. For sure. Moderate. Oh, they rejected that also. Your okay, that's fine. That is fine. Now, I don't want to spend all of our money, so we're going to let that one go right there. Uh, we can get our king married. That's going to cost 530, so that's actually going to be the end of our money there. Uh, let's take a look and see who likes us and who doesn't. They Neither one of them like us. Why do you not like me? Okay, so difficulty level and because he has the xenophobe. Minus two loyalty for each faction with you have... Which you have... Mm -mm, mm, okay, well, that, that kind of sucks. Uh, this is the fleet that's down there, and this is the general. Okay, so I mean, we both we have them in armies at least, so they're not completely pissed off at everything. So right, I feel like that's good. We're gonna uh, get an end turn here, and let's see what transpires. So guys, hopefully you guys do enjoy this campaign. Uh, please make sure to hit the like button on the videos that come, and obviously this one as well. Drop some comments down below. Like I said, let me know we what you guys think. Oh, between our so you're going to offer me... Some arrangement I was just asking that for nothing. Prosperity and strength. Moderate. Yeah, I'll take 200 gold for it. That's fine. Like I said, we'll start working. Maybe we can get a military alliance with them. That would be uh, pretty awesome to be able to do we that. You, uh, so now this God. army in here... I think we're going to hold off again. Let's I'm get some more... Yeah, we have 1,700 gold. Let's get a couple more slingers. So that'll be six slingers in that army and i do want to get my king married so let's get him married off there and we will what is she wearing on her face she's got like a face mask that's pretty awesome looking uh we are going to promote her up because it is free to do that so there we go for that and let's get the spy moving we're gonna head up over here into the gera territory and uh be ready we're going to be ready. We're going to get this army. He's actually going to be recruiting two more slingers, which were they one turn? Oh, they are just one turn. Oh, did I recruit from the wrong? Oh, oh no, I did mean to recruit him, but actually, hold on. Let's knock that down for a second. We're going to get him over to the border, and then we'll recruit the, uh, the two slingers there. Now, we are going to be getting spearmen here. The desert spearmen, a couple more slingers. Garrison is okay. Uh, oh, no, that's here. Hold on. Eight garrison. Not bad. Not bad. Now, in here, does this just go straight line? Oh, yeah, it does.
All right, so we're going to get some being swordsman. What does that do? Tech. We need logistics. Is that the first tech for... It is. Okay. So once... Maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do that. Once the civil is done, then we'll get into the logistics and be able to get that. We'll be able to get the Sabian Swordsman. I'm actually a fan of Sabian Swordsman. I feel like they are pretty good uh, as far as, you know, frontline kind of stuff. So, all right. Uh, that is pretty much going to be the end of our turn. Again, unless we can get Axum to maybe do a... Uh, non aggression. I mean, it's saying hi. My ears await I mean, if I could get 500 out of them for that, that would be great. Okay, there we go. All right, so we're we up over 1200 now. Very, very nice. They like us a lot more, but don't. Yeah, they're already at war with Kush, so they're not going to be around very long. They are not going to be around for a whole yes. lot of time. Uh, but 1,200 gold, I feel like that is an okay amount you, to kind of sit with. We are making 854 a turn, so let's kind of shovel it around again. We will be able to start recruiting spearmen in this next turn, which will be nice. The spearmen are obviously a little bit better than the desert levies. That'll be good. Oh, sage level, very nice. Let's get to him real quick. Let's bump that up, and we will give him... The, um, which one do I give him? Plus five growth in province while deployed. Minus four costs for crush constructions. That's actually going to be really nice. Let's get that. Let's get that. We'll get the, uh, what is that? Mimar? Mimar? Mimar, maybe? We'll get that ability for him, which should make anything else that we build cheaper. Looks like it does make it a little bit cheaper. And that will allow the garrison to have... Um, does it give it anything extra? I don't think it does. That building did. It gave it two more levy skirmishers. Uh, we cannot build anything else just yet, though. So we're going to have to wait. This will be good because it will give us... Uh, some more commerce, some more money. So that'll be actually 180 extra a turn. So that'll definitely be nice. Sorry, this gentleman right here. I'm going to get him some more of the Desert Spearmen. Are you ready to serve? Four, five. five. Oh, can only do four. Uh, I feel like maybe he'll be all right to just sit there, though. Yeah, Desert Spearmen are better than the Desert Levy. Not by a ton. They get the bonus first large. That's definitely big. Uh, they get some more melee defense. They get some more base morale. Doesn't look like their armor is any different. Their melee attack is up by one. So it's not really that big of a deal. Uh, but we do have the six of them. Maybe... What do we got for mercenaries here? Since merc Oh, Moscow Marauders. That would be very nice to get a Moscow Marauder. Feel like that would change. Oh, even a mercenary, but look at that. They're they're they're, they're kind of expensive. We're gonna grab this uh, mercenary mascot marauder though. We'll grab one of them. So that's 19, and then we'll finish the army off with another unit of the desert spearmen. So that's gonna be a full army. That will be a full 20 stack. Let's get this guy to move down a little bit further over here. Let's see what we got. What is inside Gerhar? They have a seven garrison, a nine garrison total. And he's got nine so far. So it's nine, nine, and then... So that's 18 against us. Let's service. move him over here. And we'll let him start stealing I some go. food. So there you go. Deploy him. Now we're positive in food. Very nice. And okay. So we're making 524 a turn now. Not the greatest. Not the greatest. But it will turn around next turn. It will turn around. So let's go another one here. Anybody doing it? Oh, he's starting to form another army. Interesting. Uh, in recent years of civilization, and the sink in the desert of sands, blah, 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 blah. speaks of our origins, rekindling pride amongst the people. Support him. Yeah, support him. Obviously. Obviously. Obviously, we're going to support him. All right, so we're making 525. We fight for you, my lord. Uh, you actually need some men in this garrison. Let's get some men in here. We're just going to give him some Desert Levy, right? Yeah, we'll give him some Desert Levy. Are you ready two units of Desert Levy in there. Hopefully that will help the uh, 
Public orders start running around a little bit. We could actually... Hmm. At your command. Actually, what should we do? Oh, that's right. Military. Let's get the logistics going. Let's get that logistic going. Maybe I... You know what? I think I'm just going to leave him there. And they are already losing food. They are already losing men. That is gigantic. That is gigantic. All right, you are recruiting your final one. So next turn, we will be declaring war over there. Now, does this... Hold on a second. Do these guys like if we're at war with people? Pacifist. Minus five of loyalty per faction. He's not going to be... This guy's going to be annoying. This guy's going to really be annoying to deal with. And that is not going to be fun. If he didn't have that pacifist, I feel like I'd be all right. They, I mean, he's just got Patriot. Army present on players' territory. Yeah, they, they don't have any enemy armies here. Traditionalist, though. What is that? Plus one loyalty for each province where players' culture is dominant. <sighs> yeah, this guy's going to be annoying. I wish he didn't have that pacifist. Pacifist is always irritating to deal with. Minus five loyalty per faction you are at war with. Max of minus 15. Well, I mean, hopefully this war with Gauhar won't be very long. Hopefully it won't be. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Do I see Nabatea? Ooh, wait a second. Do I see Nabatea? I do not. I do not see Nabatea. Maybe... We maybe f send this guy up. See if we can find Nabatea. Maybe we should do that. Yeah, let's head, let's head him up. I mean, the... Public order is still at minus five, so it doesn't really matter. This guy's holding the fort down for the moment. All right, let's get another end turn going. We're at minus one. We're at one food now, probably because I uh, sent that fleet out, or probably actually because I made this an army of twenty. Uh, defensive alliance, huh? No, no, because you're not going to be around long enough. And you were asking me for money? Get out of here! I ain't paying you no money. Kush is going to destroy you. Now watch, this is going to be like, oh, spy leveled up, very nice, glorious fortune. Minus three loyalty for all political parties, plus six morale, percent morale for all units, plus one public order in all provinces. So that just made these guys even more mad at me, right? Um, did I read that wrong? I feel like that went down. I feel like that went down. Did that go down? All right, let's head up over here. Maybe we can see both. Maybe we can find Kush and Nabatea. No, I went the wrong way. I should have gone over here. Don't. Oh, I do see Kush. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Not aggression pack with Kush. Moderate. Come on. Yeah. Trade. Low. Dang it. Okay, they don't want trade. But we got an aggression pack with them. That is good. What about you guys? You're way over there. Do you want trade agreement? No, you don't. Okay. Uh, mascot, we're already trading with you. 97. My friend. Do you want a defensive alliance? Not yet. Not yet. Probably asking way too... Oh, yeah, they're only at 50. They're only at 50 right now. All right. So, but Mascot likes Gerha, but they like me more. Yeah. We're going to declare war on them. I greet you in my master's... Oh, uh, hold on a second. Let me see. Are they still... Are they still suffering? They are. They are still suffering losses. Is it still a minus four food? Yeah, okay. So we're going to declare war on them. Get this party started. I greet you in declare my war on them. There we go. Very nice. Get you moving up this road here. How far can you go? You can go to about here, looks like. On the move, my lord. That's about as far as you can go, right? Yeah, that's about as far as you can go. Okay, not bad. Not a bad thing. We will be attacking the settlement next turn, so that will definitely be nice. And the garrison is dwindling as well. So, very nice. Now, I want to see, actually, how much does Gerha have? I think they only have just this one settlement. I don't think they have anything else. I don't think they do. All right. Well, we're gonna, I'm going to bank the money. I'm going to bank the money, I think. Yeah, because I'd like to start being able to promote... Start to uh, build... 
in the uh, in the settlement here itself just a little bit but we do need some well we'll be able to build this one soon we'll be able to build that one soon it's all right let's uh end the turn here and see what oh who got a point At your command. hold on a second oh the spy that's right Damn dang it no. forgot all right let's get that spy uh that one i always like you maxing out the uh the food stolen one just it's just a thing for me i don't know why i don't really know if it means anything or not but i do like stealing the food <laughs> really you scumbags why why would you do that there was no purpose in doing that at, at all what are you doing are you just killing yourself like what is going on there troubled populace yeah Great gain, very nice. All right, let's get back in here with Kush. What happened, Kush? Why did you? Yeah, let's get this going again. Oh, now it's low. You want to trade? No. Um. Can I break the this with these guys? Of my household no, are not yet. Yours, well, they're going to be dead soon. Kush is. I think Kush is already starting to make their way down there. Uh, hold on. Let's try to. These guys again, but he's the one that sent the fleet out into the middle of the water. A patient audience for yeah, this. no, they don't want to trade. They do not want to trade. Moscow, do you want to do anything Lord's more? Name. No. All right. Well, they'd still like me, even though we do went to war with... Yeah, we're still fine. We're still fine. All right, let's get this army in here. Ready for we will attack the settlement. The settlement. And we're going to hold off. We're going to hold off, see if maybe they come to us. If they come to us, then we'll just fight them out on the open field. Uh, but we will build a couple more pieces of siege equipment there. Continue the siege. I mean, they are still losing that food. Well, now they're not. But they're they're dwindled. They're really, really dwindled. They do not have a lot of men. So, all right. We got 1,500 now. We need to still get to that 2,200. So, we still have to uh, keep saving. So, we're just going to jump into another turn here. Actually, our food went up. So, we're at plus three food now. That's big. And we also have to check on our fleet over there. And uh, we saw Kush already, so let's see if we can move up a little bit further north and find Nabatea. He's, I don't know what this guy's doing. He's just kind of sailing around. You want a non-aggression pact, huh? No. And no, no non-aggression pact for you. Because I'm coming after you next. Essentially, I'm going to be coming after you next. Uh, our agent is... That's fine. Doesn't matter if he's exposed. Increased in rank. The sage went up again. Very nice. Very nice. Population surplus. That I like to see. Okay. Let's get a public order building in here. I know that we're really close to making our money, but we need a public order building in here because the public order is still being a problem. So let's get the... I guess we'll go for here. Let's get the shrine going in there. Let's get him I'll again. We're going to upgrade this guy. Um, I thought there was one. That's enemy territory. I thought there was one that uh, raised his. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we do have to finish this one. All right, so we'll finish that one first. Let's get up here. Find us some uh, Nabatea. Faction encountered. Very nice. Okay, let's talk to them. Nabatia, hello, hello. And you are at war with that guy already. Cool. Good stuff. Non-aggression so pact? Yo, yeah, oh, no, he did not want that. Do you want a trade agreement? No, he doesn't want that either. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, let's head over here. See if we can find it. Egypt? Did we find Egypt? We did. That would be amazing if we could get something with them. But they are at war with a bunch, a bunch of people already. So we're actually going to hold off on that. We're going to hold off on the uh, on the Egypt for the moment. Let's talk to Kush again. See, 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 see. Non-aggression pact? No. Trade? No. Okay. Oh, we have the no. I have. What do I have? I have lead. Oh no, I'm importing lead. All right. All right. Well, I don't. I guess they're not going to attack us. I guess they're not coming out. So we're going to have to go in there to them. To battle. See, I don't know if he's still losing food. I don't know. 
So let's just do it. Let's just attack. We'll auto resolve it. And we'll do the protective stance to have the most men left over. We will occupy it. So there we go. So Gerha has been knocked back. They are not dead. They still have this little baby fleet out there, but they have nothing now. They have nothing. They can do nothing. And we're making more money now, which is big. It's definitely very, very, very big. Uh, let's build this. Oh, wait. No, no, no. We have enough. Do we have enough? Yes. Good. Build that. Build that up now, sir. You can continue your way. You're going to head over there towards uh, Yathrib. Get on over there and start doing some stuff. We have a technology we can do now. Uh, minus three upkeep for armies. Might not be a bad thing to do. Minus three percent upkeep. What should we get in here? Plus two trade tariff. Plus two wealth from all commerce. Uh, rank one dignitaries or yeah I think we're gonna go here actually we'll get that done first uh, because we can recruit Nabatean sword uh, not Nabatean we can recruit Sabian swordsman wait oh no I gotta upgrade this again I forgot that's gonna be another 1200 well a couple turns a couple turns we can get some Sabian swordsman Sabian archers as well that wouldn't be bad it really would not be a bad thing to get all right, so we're taking out them. We are a little bit stronger. Mascot, let's see. Still at 42. More defensive alliance? No, they don't. Uh, Kush, since I'm a little bit stronger now, do you want to... No. No, he doesn't want to do that either. What about you guys? Do you want to trade? Welcome, friend. Welcome. Nope, they don't want to trade. Why? Why don't they want to trade? I don't understand. Uh, Quidri, you're probably not going to be around very long. Yeah, you're already at war with... Oh, you actually left. Wasn't he a satrapy of Seleucid? I, I don't remember off the top of my head. But that was another nice uh, turn right there. So let's get it. Oh, our king leveled. I forgot. Oh my god, our army got wrecked. Holy crap. A lot of damage done to the army. Jesus. Jesus. For you, my lord. Wow, you guys took a lot of damage. I mean, I know it's just Sabine Spearman, but dang. Dang, 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 dang. Well, let's uh, merge them all together. There we go. Now we're pretty much back to where we were. We had 15 units. The Moscow Marauders are really damaged. Really, really damaged. How long do they take? Seven turns. The Camels are going to take 15 Oh, I'm sorry, not 15, 10 and 9. So this army's going to have to sit for a little while. That is a little frustrating. Little frustrating. But the public order should turn around pretty quickly. Should turn around. It's only going to be minus 20 for now. We are building the public order building in here. That's only going to take two turns. So hopefully public order starts turning around and getting a little bit more simple to deal with. Um, oh, what is this? I'll tell you with a little baby fleet right there. All right, let's get another red turn. I humbly propose this. You want a defensive alliance. You see the merit of closer ties with our people. No. I mean, I'm going to break it here in the next couple of turns. I just saw it as an opportunity to get some money. Oh, you want trade, huh? That sucks. Oh, and they're willing to give high trade. Pro that sucks. That sucks. If I didn't, uh, if I didn't need your turn, Lord. Sw oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Burn that. Burn that frankincense right now. Right now, buddy. Right now. Faction destroyed. Oh, Nabatia won. Nabatia got there first. Minus 2% tariff income from trade agreement. You suck, dude. You are not good. You are a horrible, horrible, horrible king. I hate you. I really hate you right now. That was our, in like, that's our money, dude. Oh, we got a full 20 stack here, but it's a bunch of easy, oh, levy spearmen, not even, 
Not even Eastern Spearmen. They got Levy Spearmen, but they have a pretty good garrison. Oh, no, they don't. Oh, that's me. Hold on. Yeah, no, they have a pretty good garrison. All right, well, we're going to have him start stealing some food here as well. Let's take a look at Nabatea again. 18. Past treaties with Kush. They actually like the fact that I talked Welcome, to Kush. Honored emissary. Speak, and I will answer oh, I still don't want to trade. Can I break with uh, Axum yet? Let's see. Please be seated and Four take more turns. Wine. Wow, I thought it was, was going to be way quicker than that. Uh, Egypt. I mean, let's Let see. Non-aggression pact. All they would go medium with that. What about trade? Our today, Low. Okay, so they don't want to trade profit. either. Okay. Get, oh, are you raiding me? Are you raiding me? Yep. Get out of here. Go away. Go away. Oh, I can catch him. I can catch him, actually. Yeah, let's do that real fast. Let's just hit him. Get him out of here. Kill them off completely. 99, 99. Yep. Bye-bye. That should be the end of Gerha right there. And we are going to release the captives. And there they go. Okay, good. They are gone. Actually, he leveled up again. Nice. Let's get him back heading towards the uh, um, towards the settlement. Plus two public order. Six morale for all armies against raiding armies. Minus uh, plus three missile damage, or plus five weapon damage inflicted by all spear. Ar oh, we do have a ton of spears right now, so I guess we'll do that. I guess we will get that one. Um, we can't do anything up here still because we don't have the technologies. What is it at? Three? Minus three? So it should be. It should be okay. Uh, next one is probably... Let's see. Where are we going to go next? Mm, plus 5% wealth from culture. 100 from learning. We'll probably go with the Altar of Shams. Gives an okay gar uh, good public order bonus. Money from culture. Yeah, I don't need to go through that one. That's a lot. 24 public order for the max building. That's crazy. Uh, two, but that's a lot of money. That one's a lot of money income. 400 from learning. Mm. Well, that's another decision we're going to have to make down the road. So, all right, let's... I uh, guess that's going to be the end of this turn. So, let's roll another one around here. Uh, also, I'm not really sure how long these episodes are going to be. I might make these, like, initial ones for all three of these campaigns. Maybe make them about I an hour. I'm mean, sorry, about 45 minutes long. I mean, do you want... Do, do, would you? Would you... Oh, I can't even do that. Okay, never mind. No. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to mess with Kush. I really don't want to mess with Kush. I'd rather get some sort of a... Uh... Oh, Locust. Nice. Plus 40% tariff. Yeah. Oh, wealth. I'm sorry. Wealth from agriculture. Minus 5 tariff income from trade fashion. Dang it. Oh, well. It is what it is. It is what it is. We just got more income from the... Uh... Got more income from agriculture, so. Tribal Confederation. The Celtic... Oh, God. The Celtiberian Confederation already. What? That happened really fast. Really, really fast. You guys should be dying off. Right? Yeah, you're dying off. Yep. Army is dying off pretty quickly. Minus two on the food. Very, very nice. Let's get you back in here. So you can continue replenishing those troops. Now we're at six turns and six turns. Good. Good, 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 good. We can actually upgrade here. Be plus two to public order. But the public order is actually not bad. Hold on a second. Let's pull him back out of here for a second. It's at nine. It's at eight. So he does have to stay here for a little bit. He's going to have to stay around here for a little while. Maybe building this wouldn't be a bad idea. Plus two public order, plus three growth, and a hundred from farming. Which, does this have... Oh, it's got farms right there. That's got a farm. Oh. Medea took them out. Oh, I thought Nabatea got them. Oh. But isn't Medea... Uh, a Seleucid ally? 
This is satrapy, I mean. Hmm. How strong are they? They are stronger than us. But Egypt does not like them. So they're at war with them. Nabatea, let's try and talk. I don't Welcome, remember if I did it this turn. Welcome. Come. We're going to keep trying to talk to them. The Maybe they'll do something with us. Maybe. Maybe if I get back into good graces of Kush. I will be a patient no. audience for your speech. Be sure that you bring it. How many more turns is it? Greetings, my friend. Greetings. Three turns. I think Three more turns. All right, so let's get another. Oh, oh, technologies. That's right. Oops, 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 oops. All right, so we did this one. Let's see. Two minus two grain silo or three tariff. I think getting the armies to be cheaper would be a good idea for right now. Plus, it gives me horse studs. Not really sure what building that is. And yes, yes, we will start building. Oh, I can upgrade this again. Oh, I can. I can get the Sabian swordsman now. Minus one food. We're fine with food. Yeah, build it. Build it. Three turns. Very nice. And I should be able to get these guys. That's the public. Okay, so that's the one that I want. So I will start building the altar of... Oh, is that the one that I want? Hold on a second. Well, now I don't remember. Crap. I thought it was the altar of shams that I wanted. Or temp yeah, altar temple and then the uh, great temple. It was shams that I wanted. It is the shams, because the shams gives me actual money. Yeah, okay. So we're going to build the altar of shams, hopefully, next turn. Yes, we will be able to build that next turn. Very nice. Okay. So that'll be good. More uh, public order income. Very good. All right. Let's get another intern rolling around. Oh, I totally forgot to move him. I wanted to bring him back into the settlement down there and see if maybe that was going to help with the... Uh, with the public order. Probably not, though. Drangenia. Don't know what you guys are doing. You guys are just kind of floating around over here, sailing back and forth. Spy increased. Very nice. All right, let's get him to move down. I'm just going to give him the order to go there. Uh, war declared. Maine and Medea. Okay. Well, I'm going to have to move. Oh. Now Nabatea went after Medea also. Oh, they didn't get into an alliance, did they? Did Nabatea and Maine get into an alliance? They did not. Okay. But Nabatea does like them a lot. Yeah, they really like them a lot. Holy crap. Holy crap. Speak. We are men of words. I don't think so I'm gonna get anything with Nabatea. I don't think I'm gonna get anything with Nabatea, which is really gonna be frustrating. I will be a patient audience for your Come speech. on, dude. Sure that you Come on. You suck. You suck. Ready can you come orders. out of here yet? Hopefully he can. Make haste, man. Nope. It's at minus five. Still can't come out of there yet. <laughs> Still cannot come out of there yet. Uh, I wonder if maybe it's at plus one now. Probably not gonna be enough though. My lord. Let's see. No, it's at minus two, but it's already at negative 38. So, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to move him out until I get this guy back around down over here. Maybe that'll allow him to... Uh, maybe that will allow the settlement, the province, I mean, to be uh, a little bit more stable. Let's see about talking to Mascat. We haven't talked to them in a couple of turns. Is this gone? It's gone down. It's actually gone down. Hmm. It was at 42. I don't really know Be what welcome. I did you have my full to make attention. it worse. My ears with them. await your words as willing slaves. Hmm. Military alliance? No. Wanna be a satrapy? No. Okay. It's worth a shot. It's worth a shot. So we're gonna have a pretty quick turn here. Oh wait, wait, wait. No, that's right. I wanted to build the public order building here. We wanted to build the altar of champs. That's right. Okay. This will give me more spices to trade. It'll take away two more food. Give me an extra 350 plus another four. Ooh. That's three turns. Is this three turns also? It is. 
I think we're going to build this actually first. That'll give us more trade. More things to trade with. I think that would be a much better shout. You guys are dying, right? You guys are actually dying off. Minus five food. Wow, yeah. Is that a noble sword? Yep, noble swordsman. These guys are all just dying. Dying, 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 dying. And the garrison, pretty much, probably dead too. Almost. They're on their way out. Alright, cool. Oh, skill point. Skill point. Oh, what the heck? Get down here. Skill oh, point for I the say, spy. Man. We're going to let him get that uh, other food right there. Fine. I don't care if they see him. They can't do anything to him. They don't have any spies. There are no, uh, you know, none of their, um, um, I just blanked on what they're called. Just blanked on what they're called. But they don't have anybody out here that can kill him. So that that is always nice. Okay, Alliance Forge, no! Did not need that. That I definitely did not need right now. Not good. Not good. Axum, are you still... Please accept as a most humble audience for your turn. Okay. My lord. Twelve. On the move, my lord. Number five. So I'm going to need to build this next. Get that public order up a little bit more. All right, so unfortunately, he's going to still have to just hang out there. Oh, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Oh, I can recruit one. Ooh. Minus three upkeep for parents' army. Two replenishment. Oh, yeah, we're going to do that guy. We're going to get that guy rocking. And you are going to get into this army quickly. Make it cheaper. And let it replenish faster. That will definitely be helpful. All right, let's get another turn. Again, it'll only be two turns before I can start building that public order building up there. The public order and growth building up in Gerha. So, it's not really that big of a deal. That Nabatea teaming up with Maiden, though, that, that's a little annoying. That is definitely a little annoying. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's off. Hey! Hey! Research completed. Nice. Alright. Um, yeah, I don't really care about that. Where is... Oh, that's way over there. Hold on a second. Seven missile damage. Ten shots per sh minute for all ships. Oh, that's just ship stuff. Wait, what? That's weird. Sieging stuff. Don't really need that. All right, let's get back into the civil here. Uh, plus 3% commerce, plus 3% tariff. I think we're going to get, I think we're going to go for armed escorts. I think that's the one we're going to go for next. Probably would not be a bad idea. Let's get that one. It's three turns. It's three turns. We can do it. So the infantry tents are now done. So we can get some Sabian swordsmen into the blood. armies. We can get some of the archers as well. Yeah, there we go. A little bit better. Sabian archers. Not the greatest archers in the game, but, I mean, there's, they're archers. They are archers. Sabian swords with 110. Oof. That is quite the jump. That is quite the jump. There's some Sabian spearmen, though. And they are... The swordsmen are kind of expensive. Is this place... Okay, let's see. Waiting it's for at more zero. Orders. I think, I, should, I think I should start recruiting this army up a little bit. So we're going to get rid of these two desert levy. And we're going to start recruiting actual proper troops in here. It we'll get one, one Sabine swordsman. Maybe, should I get rid of that mascot? I forget exactly how much he costs. Hold on a second. 
It's 182 a turn. My How Lord. much of the civilian swords win a turn? 110. Oh, wait. Let's get this How guy in here. I I realize that. Yep, military I training. Get on in there, bud. Start training these boys up. We're going to get rid of the mascot, Maroi. It should save... Yeah, it saved us a little bit more money. Okay. And getting him in there saved more money as well. So that is definitely a good thing on uh, both of those fronts. So, all right, we got one Sabian Swordsman coming in here. Uh, let's get some Sabian Archers. Yeah, they're only... How much are the Slingers? 74. So the Archers and Slingers are the same amount. But the Slingers actually... Hold on. Now, the Slingers are uh, cheaper to of initially recruit, and they have a higher merit range. So let's grab one of them. Let's grab one of them. Yeah. Yeah. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. We just need to wait for this building. Got to get the money for this building. But that's only going to take... We can actually get this next turn. We can start building that building next turn. That'll be good. Okay. So I really just want to start moving out here. I feel like sitting. We're, we're stagnant. We're not doing anything. You're um, no, no. And that was the final turn. That should have been the final turn right there. So I should be able to break that with him and then maybe talk to Kush. I might have to leave that one sit though. Oh, okay. oh, there we go. Yep, let's get that going. Encouraged populace. Very nice. Large spice depot built here. Very good. That's going to be growth here also. Let that level up faster. All right. So let's get into here. Axum. It should have been the final turn. Accept us a most yes. Humble so I can do it now. Good. Now, I don't we think Kush done. is going to be, do you know, ready to just I jump right back in here. Moderate. Oh, they took it. Wow. Go trade, trade, trade. No, no trade. No trade. No trade. Um... Egypt, do you want to trade? Maybe. I'm the ears of divine tale. No, they don't want to trade. What about you guys? I mean, you guys are still Speak, just sitting over friend. there. And burden yourself. No, nope, they don't want to trade either. They have a lot of, uh, they have a lot of stuff though. Interesting. 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 All right. Uh, yeah, I think that's going to be the end of this turn. So let's roll one around after I. Uh, Give this guy his point, because I totally forgot to do that. What is this? Plus two growth. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to mac. We're gonna hit that one up again, plus four tariffs. So that's going to be more money income from trade. That'll be nice. All right, let's get another intern around. We are over that 45-minute time limit. Uh, so this is probably going to be the final turn around. We're going to see what comes of it. And this guy's just doing whatever he wants to do. He's not really doing much, but he's doing whatever he wants to do. Uh, Warlord has leveled. Oh, no. Who is that? Oh, oh, it's them. Oh. Wait a second. Troubling news speaks of a plague gripping this foreign army. Contact should be avoided. Oh, yeah. No, I wasn't. I didn't plan on going over there, but <laughs> really did not plan on going over there. So, all right, money's coming in pretty nicely. Oh wait, oh 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 oh, oh yeah 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 yeah. Where is it? Forty unit experience. Nice. Money is coming in nicely now. That is coming in nicely now. Can you move out? Still can't move out. Jesus. Well, once this is done, because I only brought it down to a negative one. Once this is done, two more turns should be good to go. Um, we could upgrade this. It was the Altar of Shams, right, that I wanted to do? Let's just double check it again. Yeah, okay. So we'll start building this. Boom, there you go. Can still recruit some more men in here, probably. One slinger. Okay, it's something. Something is better than nothing. But alright guys, that is going to be the end of episode 1. So I mean, we started we started off pretty strong. We started off pretty strong. We've already doubled our kingdom size. Uh, so that is definitely nice. Let's talk to Kush one more time. Let's see what they like. They're 43. Maybe they want to trade Please now. Accept 
Ooh. Yes. More money. More money. 130 income from them. What are you guys giving me? Mascot, are you up higher too? 101. Okay. Okay, so we got some okay money coming now. That is very, very nice. Very, very nice. I like the fact that we're getting Kush as a uh, the beginning of an ally here. And they actually don't... Ooh, Nabatee actually doesn't mind Kush. But they're the defensive ally with Maine. And I'm not at war with Maine yet. So that could present to be a problem. It could. It could. But that is going to be the end right there, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed. Please make sure to hit the like button for this video. Drop some comments down below. Down below. Let me know what you guys thought. Obviously, I'm going to ask you guys to share the content around. And, of course, subscribe to the channel if you are new. But that is going to be the end for me today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Stay safe. And, as always, until the next one. Hey, guys. I just wanted to take this opportunity to send a special thanks to my Patreon supporters and my YouTube members. Thank you very much for your continued support. I really appreciate it.